Abi ya lava banana blind değil bu What makes me a f- I can feel like you just like see it in your eyes. Also, are you high? <laughs> yeah. Damn. She fall. She fall. I can't lie. She fall. Thank you. Hi. How you doing? Hi. My name's Harley. Alyssa, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. How are uh, you feeling? I'm a little nervous. It's okay, me too. I'm Savia. I'm Millie. She's so pretty. That's what I'm saying, bro. Do you mostly date women? Um, I'm now diving into dating women. Okay, okay. So, yeah. Right. What's your first impression of each other? Beautiful hair. Um, I like your glasses. Do you guys want to take a shot before you get started? I'm down for a shot. Yeah, I'm I am as well. Cheers. Cheers. Let's start this game. <laughs> okay. Eight, you want to flip the first question? He hides. Sure. Hi. Why are you single? What's wrong with you? You know that saying, don't judge a book by its cover? Yes. I think y'all just read the book, man. I'm take a shot <laughs> <for that. laughs> okay. Why are you single? What's wrong with you? Um, there's nothing wrong. I just feel like the time, the universe hasn't aligned it for me yet. Okay, okay. How long have you been single? Um, I never had, like, a real... Yo, major red flag. Major red flag. Oh, relationship, so yeah. Interesting, interesting. Red I think flag. I'm pretty, like, picky about, like, the people I date. Usually, like, the first date goes really well, and then the date afterwards, um, there's, like, stuff that, um, gets to me after the date you're like oh not really feeling it or are you like or do you just like not text them ever again i, I would take a shot to that okay uh, that's why you're okay um, that wasn't really a difficult question bro <laughs> okay what do you find most attractive about me I like your I freckles and think. your lips oh, and your hair is super beautiful. Uh, you're just a real attractive person. <laughs> she blushing, bro. She blushing. I really like your jewelry for one. Thank you. Like style choice mm -hmm. is good and your like chain is good. Mm -hmm. I also really like your hair. Thank hair you. is like big for me. So hair, hands and arms, those are like my things. What do you find most attractive about me? I like the style, like the I mean, kind of like fuck boy, but like it looks good. Fuck boy. I mean, a little. Let's go from one to ten. A fuck boy? Yeah. 8.7. Point 0.7? Yeah. Damn. That makes me a fuck boy. I can feel like you just like see it in your eyes, like the way you make eye contact. Oh. You do give it's a little. It's in my eyes. Yeah. My soul. Nah, it's just confidence, bro. It's just confidence. Are you high? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like you're totally high. Yeah. What's something you don't normally admit on a first date? Give secret. me a deep dark secret. I want to hear. <laughs> okay, so one time back in my college days, me and my dorm mate were in a dorm, and me and a guy were having sex, and she was on the other side of the room. Of the room. I don't know if that's like a that's deep dark secret. That's not that bad. <laughs> it's just like... What's something you don't normally admit on a first date? My red flags, you know. That you're a fuck boy? I guess. I guess. <laughs> Straight to the point. Okay. Do you go on a lot of dates? Yeah, like are you dating or you kind of like, you just go out and see what happens? I just go out and see what happens, you know? You basically, you basically feed him the answer. <laughs> He's basically going to say what you said, basically. I am on the dating apps. What do you want? Hinge and Bumble. Currently. Oh, gosh. It's crazy. I just deactivated Twitter not too long ago. Oh. Yeah. Why'd you deactivate Twitter? I said Twitter. Yeah. I meant Tinder. I meant oh. Tinder. Oh. <laughs> Tinder. How high are you? I'm saying about 8.7. <laughs> <laughs> um, what is something you don't normally admit on your first date? It, it's been a while since I've been in my last relationship. Mm. I, I think that's one thing I don't say too often. Mm. Reason I, I think one thing I'm a little bit afraid of going into my next relationship is um, it's either going to end up in like marriage or um, or heartbreak. I feel like that's not, it's not a bad thing. I think also like spending time with yourself and not being in a relationship is like a good time to learn. Yeah. And like you don't want to just date someone just to date someone, which I feel like a lot of people our age do because yeah. they feel the pressure. Oof. 
what's your sign and are our signs compatible? I'm an Aquarius. I don't know what your sign is, and I'm like not an astrology. You don't have like, no bitch. guesses, no. Are you a Libra? Damn! <laughs> yo, yo. What the? F oh my oh, yo! My ex was a Libra. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm sorry, You're totally I'm sorry. Libra vibes. What are Libra vibes? The bad ones. <laughs> <laughs> so we're not compatible? Or we're... I don't think so. <laughs> I'm going to go. How could you judge someone based on their astrology sign, though? God damn. That's what are you? Oh my gosh, I'm a Queen's too. Are you really? Yes. When's your birthday? <laughs> January 26th. Oh my God, I'm the 31st. That's crazy. Oh, wow. I've never really met another. Uh -huh. Well, I have, actually. Mm -hmm. They're okay. <laughs> <laughs> If we got pregnant early into dating, what would we do? Pregnant? <laughs> yeah, like pregnant. Like a baby? Yeah, like a baby. Oh. <laughs> you legit got scared of that. I think it would be more like a conversation on mm -hmm. um, both of us. I don't think it's a decision just on myself, mm -hmm. but um, I think personally, I would um, hopefully not be in that position. I think for me, I'd want it to be really intentional. Mm -hmm. So I think I would probably lean more towards abortion. Mm -hmm. Personally. Oh. Yeah. If we got pregnant early into dating, what would we do? <laughs> no. Not right now. Mm -mm. Not right now. Mm -mm. Oof. Abortion. Abortion. <laughs> <laughs> when it comes to physical attraction, how do I compare to your exes? You're talking. Thank you. Thank you. I'm trying. I tried. Okay. Like you don't even got to try. Because it just, it just <laughs> exudes. It just Thank you. The, the vibe is totally there. You, you can feel the tension, bro. She is totally digging it right now. Like, dang. Thank you. You're welcome. Ooh. Wow. I really hope no. you don't take a shower with this one. When it comes to physical attractiveness, how do I compare to your exes? I think you're very pretty. Mm -hmm. um, I, I don't... I don't think I would compare to No, you have long. to. I would? Yeah, or you have to take a <laughs> shot. So. You're very pretty. Um, I would say you're uh, prettier than my exes. I really fished for that one. Thank you. <laughs> I got you. I got you. I got you. <laughs> thank, thank you. Thank you. How was that experience for you guys? It was good. I really enjoyed it. As we're coming up to the last questions, I'm like, oh, it's gonna be over soon. Like, I wish yeah. it would keep going. Yeah. 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 Do you guys think you'll yeah. go on a second date with each other? Yes. I would love to as well. Yeah. He'll like totally hit me up at like one a.m. Yo. Like, next this weekend. Yo. I thought she'll respond. <laughs> <laughs> she loved the dogs. Like, that's pretty real. She, she really loves loves it, honestly. But the two girls, I feel so, honestly, they hit it up. The chemistry is there. The vibe is there, totally. But um, hopefully, one of these days, they can possibly do a uh, part two to these same people. Hopefully, where they are now and see if they actually went on a date and what's not and what's not. That'd be cool. That, that's a cool suggestion.